Hey what's going on everyone welcome back again to my channel so for today's video we will be checking this device from Carlin Kit it's a wired to wireless Android auto adapter it's a plug and play device so basically what it does is it will convert your factory wired Android auto into wireless connection yes it's wireless and you don't need your phone's data cable again so let's go ahead and unbox this device Okay, so let me just open this box. So while opening this box, I'll just give you a quick run through of this product. Again, it's a plug and play device. It's very easy to install. It has 5.8 gigahertz transmission rate for faster data transmission. It also supports over the air update. It's compatible with your car's microphone. No distortion and retains your car's sound quality. Also, it's compatible with your car's touchscreen, steering wheel controls, or nav controls. Okay, so this device is very portable. It's lightweight and very handy. The adapter is just small. The package includes instruction manual in both English and Chinese. It also comes with two USB cables, one USB type A, and the other one is USB type C. Okay, so choose whatever fits into your car. In my case, I have both ports, but I will be using USB Type-C because my other port is already in use. Okay, so I already connected the adapter into my car. Now, let's go ahead and connect my phone to Android Auto. But first thing we have to do is go to the phone settings and turn on the Bluetooth. And now it's turned on, so let's just wait for a few seconds. So once the phone already searched for the uh, Carlin Kit wireless Android adapter, just tap on it, which is this one right here. It says AutoKit F3A8. Now let's wait to get it connected. There should be a Bluetooth pairing request. Oh, okay, so this one right here, just tap the pair button. So it's now being connected. Okay, so let's see what's on our car radio screen. It says USB device detected. Okay, so let's just uh, tap the OK button. Okay, so there's a prompt on my car radio. It says, would you like to use Android Auto with this device? Just tap yes. And there you go. My Android smartphone is now connected to Android Auto. So as you can see here, I don't have the cable attached into my phone. It's all wireless connection. Okay, now let's tap the continue button. Okay, so the Google map opens up and it detects my location right away. I actually just drove here to continue this video. Now let's tap this button to open and see our apps. It's actually not bad, it's fast and smooth. So when I tap the Nissan button or some device, it will show a car icon. It will go back to your original car radio interface. There's my Android Auto button. And when I tap the connection button, it will show all my devices. So my phone is connected to Android Auto and to a Bluetooth phone call. Okay, so when I press back, I can just tap the Android Auto button and it will go back to Android Auto user interface right away. So if you guys want to connect automatically to Android Auto whenever you enter and start your car, just go to the settings and look for Start Android Auto automatically. Then tap the Always button. Mine is set to default or set by the car. Okay, so I will not be discussing more about the feature of Android Auto because this video is all about the uh, Carlin Kit wireless adapter which will convert your factory wired Android Auto into wireless connection. Okay, so just a piece of reminder guys, before buying this product, make sure your car's infotainment system has touchscreen and it supports factory wired Android Auto. Then if not, do not buy this product, but if your car meets the requirements, then you can buy this device if you guys want to get connected wirelessly into Android Auto. Okay guys, uh, the good thing about this product is that whenever you start your car, the device will look your phone 
connects right away and open up Android Auto. It's hassle-free, no need to get your phone's data cable to plug it in. For me, it's very convenient and it saves my time. Well, to be honest, I love how this device reacts to every touch. It's faster and smoother compared to other competitors out there. Based on my experience, other devices are slow and laggy. This device really meets my expectation. So if you guys want to check this product out, please see the link in my description. And I guarantee you, it's worth the money if you guys want to go wireless. And by the way guys, if you want more features rather than going wireless on Android Auto, why not upgrade into something that will make your car's infotainment system into a full Android system? From there, you can watch your favorite movies from Netflix or just watch videos on YouTube and many more. If you guys want to find out how, please stop this video on your screen. Okay, so that's all for now guys. Thank you for watching and hope to see you again on my next video.